हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू द मोटिवेशन मेडिकोज माई नेम इज प्रिंस तिवारी एंड टूडे वी गोन स्टडी अबाउट द मसल्स ऑफ अपर लिम एंड देयर नर्व सप्लाई सो इट इज गोन अ वेरी इजी फॉर दैट यू जस्ट हैव टू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल दी एंड सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग अ टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो द मसल्स ऑफ अपर लिम वी जस्ट हैव डिवाइडेड इन टू द सिक्स पार्ट और राइट सो वन बाई वन विल वी आर गोन अ स्टडी अबाउट दैट सो द फर्स्ट वन दैट इज द पैक्टोरल रीजन सो वी जस्ट हैव टू स्टडी थ्री मसल्स इन दिस पैक्टोरल रीजन सो द फर्स्ट वन that is the pectoralis minor i'm just writing over here that is pectoralis minor all right so if the minor is over here so here one more thing that should be major or as, as well so the second one that is the pectoralis all right pectoralis major sorry it's a major all right and the third one that is the subclavius subclavius all right it's v so uh, in the pectoral region we do have a three muscle that is the pectoralis minor pectoralis major and the subclavius as well and the let's talk about the another one that is the scapular region so in the scapular region we just have to study total six muscles all right total six muscle so one by one we are going to study about that so the first one that is the deltoid muscle okay i'm just writing over here that is deltoid muscle and the second one that is the infraspinatus all right infra infraspinatus all right and the third one that is the if the infra is over here so the supra is as well so the supra supra spinatus all right and the fourth one that is the teres okay i'm just writing over here that is teres minor as i told you if there will be a minor so major is also there so the fifth one that is the teres okay i'm just writing over here teres major all right and the last one that is the sixth one it is sub scapularis okay i'm just writing over here that is sub scapularis so it it was all about you know the sixth muscle of scapular region now let's talk about the third one that is the you know that muscles will you know go or you know join with the uh, vertebral column or we can say which connect upper limb to the vertebral column so these are those muscles which connect you know upper limb to the vertical column so we just have to study five muscles over here so one by one we are going to study so the first one that is the trapezius all right trapezius and the second one that is the latissimus dorsi i am writing over here that is latissimus dorsi and the third one that is the levator scapulae levator scapulae all right and the fourth one that is the rhomboid i am just writing over here rhomboid minor so as i told you if there will be a minor so major is also will be there so and the fifth one that is the rhomboid major all right so this was all about the you know these are the muscles which is you know which is gonna um, connect with the vertebral column all right so these are the five muscles now let's talk about the arm region all right and the fourth one as well okay so about the arm region so okay, we just have divided okay this into the two part that is the anterior compartment and the another one that is the posterior compartment all right so in the anterior compartment we do have a three muscles okay or you know the first one that is the brachialis i'm just writing over here brachialis and the second one that is the biceps biceps brachii all right and the third one that is the okay i'm just writing over here that is croco croco brachialis so these are the muscles okay of the anterior uh, compartment of arm now let's talk about the posterior compartment so there will be only one muscle that is the triceps brachii all right triceps brachii i'm just writing over here that is triceps brachii okay now let's talk about the fifth one that is the forearm region so in the forearm region forearm region okay we do have a 
टू कंपार्टमेंट दैट इज़ द फ्रंट कंपार्टमेंट एंड अनदर वन इज द बैक कंपार्टमेंट इन द फ्रंट कंपार्टमेंट और इन अनदर हैंड दैट वी कैन से यू नो द एक्सटेंसर कम सॉरी द फ्लैक्सर कंपार्टमेंट एज वेल ओके हम दिस राइटिंग ऑफ ए दीज आर द फ्लैक्सर कंपार्टमेंट एंड दीज बैक ओके कंपार्टमेंट इज ऑल्सो सेट टू बी एक्सटेंसर वन एज वेल सो वी आर गोन ना स्टडी अबाउट ओके द फ्लैक्सर एंड द एक्सटेंसर मसल्स ओवर हेयर सो यू नो ओके सॉरी so in the front compartment we do we are going to study about two muscles the superficial one and the another that is the deep one so in the superficial one okay we are going to study about uh, total five muscles over here in the superficial muscle so one by one okay we are going to write it over here all right so the first one okay, i am just writing over here so the first one that is the pronator teres pronator teres all right and the second one that is the flexor carpi radialis okay. as i told you it is a flexor compartment so here is the flexor carpi radialis if the radialis okay will be there so you just have to understand okay one thing that if the radial one is there so there will be ulnar one as well so i'm just writing over here the another muscle that is the flexor okay flexor carpi ulnaris all right and the fourth one that is the palmaris longus palmaris longus all right and the fifth one that is the you know flexor i'm just writing over here that is flexor digitorum okay i'm just writing over here digitorum superficialis superficialis less all right so these are the muscles okay and one more thing you just have to understand over here these all five muscles okay you know have same origin all right these five you know muscles have a same origin all right now let's talk about the deep compartment of the forearm okay in the front compartment front region all right so in the deep you know we do have three muscles over here in deep okay i'm just writing over here the the first one that is the flexor digitorum profundus i'm just writing over here flexor digitorum profundus all right and the second one that is the flexor you know flexor pollicis longus okay and the third one that is the pronator quadratus okay i'm just writing over here that is pronator quadratus so these are the three muscles okay in the deep of the front compartment of forearm all right now let's talk about the back one that is the extensor compartment so let's talk about the superficial one so in the superficial okay we do have a uh, muscles like first one okay i'm just writing over here the first one that is encognis okay encognis and the second one that is the brachioradialis brachio radialis all right and the third one that is the extensor carpi radialis longus okay i'm just writing over here in the short form extensor okay carpi radialis longus all right and the fourth one that is the okay as i told you if the radialis is over there okay uh, another one that is the extensor carpi okay radialis brevis okay it's brevis okay, i'm just writing the full form over here that is brevis extensor carpi radialis brevis and this one is the longus one okay extensor carpi radialis longus and the fifth one that is the extensor digitorum and the sixth one that is the extensor digiti minimi all right the sixth one is the extensor digiti minimi all right and the another one that is the extensor okay i'm just writing over here extensor carpi ulnaris all right so these are the six seven muscle over here now let's talk about the deep one so in the deep one we have the muscles so the first one that is the supinator we are talking about the extensor compartment okay and the deep one as well so the first one that is the supinator okay, i am just writing over here that is supinator and the another one is it's the first one and the second one that is the you know abductor it's abductor okay i am just you know abductor pollicis longus and the third one that is the okay extensor okay pollicis 
previous and the fourth one that is the extensor policies longest as i told you in the you know in the flexor as well so the same one same you know here is also the policies brevis and the longest so the extensor policies longest and the fifth one that is the you know extensor indices okay i just have written over here that is the extensor indices you just have to keep one thing over here here are three muscles that is apl okay epb extensor policies longest sorry abductor policies longus extensor policies brevis and extensor policies longus these these three muscles okay will you be, will be making the snub box or we can say the uh, anatomical snub box i'm just writing over here that is anatomical snub box so maybe you have heard about the anatomical snub box if you don't know so let me know in the comment box so i'll you know make the video on this as well so these three muscles okay will gonna make the anatomical snub box so now we just have you know studied the forearm as well now we have the last one so the last one we do have the hand muscles all right so we are gonna study about the muscles of hand so the first one that is the thinar group i'm just writing over here that is thinar group so in thinar group okay we do have a muscles like you know the abductor pollicis okay brevis and another one that is the you know flexor pollicis brevis and the third one that is opponent's pollicis and the fourth and the last one that is the you know adductor pollicis it's a double d t all right a double d adductor pollicis and here as i told you the abductor pollicis brevis it's a b all, all right abductor pollicis longus now let's talk about the another one that is the hypothenar group I'm just writing over here that is hypothenar or thinar group all right i'm just writing over here group so the muscles of in this group so they are they are you know abductor it's a b okay i'm just writing over here Ab abductor digit t okay minimi okay i'm just written over here i have written over here and the another one that is the flexor digit t okay minimi it's flexor digit t minimi and the fourth one that is the you know opponents dgt minimi and the last one that is palmaris brevis it's palmaris brevis now let's and the third one these are the first second and the third one that is the lumbricals all right i'm just reading over here lumbricals and the fourth one they are palmar intro intrusi palmar intrusi okay i'm just just have written over here that is you know palmar intrusi and the fifth and the last one that is you know dorsal intro okay sorry it's over here intrusi so these are the hand muscles over here so for first one okay we have studied that is thinar group so these are the muscles of thinar group all right and the hypothenar thinar group that so these are the muscles of hypothenar and the lumbricals okay we do have four lumb lumbricals all right and four you know palmar intrusi and the four muscles of dorsal intrusi and these are the thinar and hypothenar as well so this was all about the muscles of upper limb so for, for the very first okay we have studied you know pectoral region so in the pectoral region we do have a three muscles okay wait for a second we do have a you know three muscles okay in pectoral region the pectoralis minor pectoralis major and the subclavius as well and in the subclavius you know sub sub sorry scapular region we do have a six muscle the deltoid one uh, infraspinatus supraspinatus teres minor and the teres if the minor is here the major is also will be there so the teres major and sub scapularis as well and in the you know the muscles okay which are gonna connect the upper limb to the vertebral column so these are the five muscles the trapezius sorry trapezius latissimus dorsi levator scapulae rhomboid minor and the major as well okay and the, the fourth one that we have studied about the arm so we do have a two compartment in arm okay the first one that is the anterior and the another one we do have a posterior so in the anterior region okay we do have a three muscle that is brachialis biceps brachii and croco brachialis and the posterior region we do have only one muscle that is triceps brachii all right 
now let's talk about the forearm region so in the forearm region we have divided into two compartment that is front compartment or we can say the flexor compartment and the back compartment or we can say the extensor compartment as well so in the front compartment the superficial one okay are we do have a pronator teres flexor carpi radialis flexor carpi ulnaris all right and palmaris longus and the last one that is flexor digitorum superficialis all right and the, now let's talk about the back one so we do have a cell muscle in the superficial region of the back compartment of the forearm so the first one that is ancogneus second one that is brachioradialis and the last one that is the ec longus okay and there will be a you know extensor carpi radialis brevis extensor digitorum okay extensor digiti minimi extensor you know carpi ulnaris now let's talk about the deep one deep one so we do have studied in the deep one that is supinator okay and uh, you know supinator abductor pollicis longus okay ex extensor you know pollicis brevis is an extensor pollicis longus and the you know last one that is the you know extensor indices so in these okay in the deep one okay we just have studied okay these three muscles that is you know apl okay ebp and epl these three okay will make the snub box the anatomical snub box all right we have you know studied or you know i'll make the video over this as well now let's talk about the head muscles so in the head muscles okay we do have a thinar group in the thinar group we do have these muscles and in hypothenar group okay we do have these muscles okay and you know we do will have the four you know lumbricals and you know four palmar interosei and the four you know dorsal interosei so these all these you know these are the muscles of upper limb and will you know study all the nerves okay of these muscles in the next video i hope this video has given you the good understanding about the muscles of upper limb as always thanks for watching